So I had decided to pull out of this bodybuilding competition. You have to excuse my voice a little bit because I'm just getting over the flu. But, <clears throat> see what I mean? <laughs> I sound like a frog. Uh, you're just going to bear with me tonight. I wanna, we're just doing a quick uh, leg workout. Um, we've got some really cool things planned this weekend. We're, going, we're filming all day tomorrow. So this is actually my second workout today. I feel numb this morning. Uh, we're going to hit a quick leg workout tonight because I'm not going to get an opportunity to do it because I've got these really, really cool ideas to um, film on the Sunshine Coast tomorrow, so that's going to be an all day thing. Uh, so we're going to suck it up now, and we're going to get this workout in tonight. We're going to get it done. Alright, so follow me, let's get it done, and let's have some fun. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're starting off with leg press because I've been having a bit of um, fluid build up on my knee. You know, um, don't know what it is yet, still going to go get it checked out. Um, so I think I feel like something's not tracking properly, so you know, I'm avoiding squats um, and you know, anything that's going to make my knees break past my degrees. So you know, this leg workout today, we're just going to focus on um, hitting the leg press, just stopping at 90 degrees, getting a good stimulation through the quads and the glutes. All right, and then we're going to go move on to um, some, um, some lunges and leg extensions. Um, and then we're going to finish off with some calves. So it's just glutes and quads and calves tonight. And you know, so I'm going to show you how I'm going to work around this, you know, fluid retention in my knee, um, you know, just to make sure that we stay safe. Because guys, it's the most important thing. Injuries are going to occur; they're going to happen every now and then when you least expect it. All right. So, but you don't want to stop training. You don't want to stop your momentum. You want to be able to get in there and still get the job done. So this is how we're going to do it. Get your notepad out. We're just warming up, increase the weight slowly, slowly, slowly until we find a good working weight. Okay, yeah, we're going to pop out another full working set today. We are booking Lawrence some flights to go to Melbourne this week.
to tear up some business meetings. We've got a convention on. We're gonna have an absolute ball. We're gonna meet up with some people down there. So we are super excited. And uh, Lawrence is getting his flights booked. He's getting his, what, BCAAs in. And he's <laughs> getting his legs is. done as well. The man's on fire. <laughs> always busy, always networking. I've always got something going on. We got my man here, Vaughn. Uh, we're booking flights for Melbourne because we got business stuff going on down there. Oh. So we're super pumped. So now we've got a convention happening uh, next weekend down in Melbourne. So we're getting stuff prepared. Uh, Lawrence is having to train legs, not having to, but he wants to train legs. So we train legs and we do business at the same time. Train right? legs, do business. That's how roll. <laughs> Toes, buzz, gonna do the flex <laughs> on. Yeah. This, we got the grey happening. Yeah. Matching. <laughs> Alright, so what I've got to do, if I go, yep, that's fine, go for it. Throw some trainer. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> yeah! Oops. So, you know, um, so I had decided to pull out of this bodybuilding competition. You know, um, it was a big decision of mine to make, um, but what it came down to was, you know, I just got really unwell. Uh, you know, the, literally two weeks ago, I started, started experiencing, you know, really intense migraines um, in the middle of the night. Um, fevers, night sweats, you know, these were these going on for a couple of days, so, you know, it really affected my training. I really couldn't do anything about it, and I went and got some blood tests and got some MRIs to see what was going on. Thankfully, the MRI came back okay, so just the doctor just thinks it was, you know, just too much stress, taking on a lot, taking on too much. Because, um, you know, not, not only was I comp prepping, I also have a full time job. I um, have two online businesses as well, so I was literally the, you know, I had every single part of my day with micro managed to maximize to fit in everything that I do. So, you know, um, I was absolutely, I like, not you know, complaining about anything. I was enjoying absolutely everything I was doing. I was taking on all these amazing opportunities that were coming my way. I didn't want to say no to anything. 
because I'm just that kind of guy, you know, an opportunity comes my way and I'm going to give it everything I've got, um, you know, and, uh, and I think at this point it really, really took it out of me, <clears throat> you know, I, I grinded and grinded and grinded and I wasn't listening to my body and I hadn't had a rest day, you know, probably three months, you know, so, which is all cool, but, you know, when you get to the point where your food gets so low, getting closer to the prep, uh, closer, closer to comp during prep, you literally just you lose that recovery. And, you know, I think that's what happened. I just lost that recovery, but I was still putting in the, the work, um, not only physically, but you know, mentally with the business stuff as well on the side. So, you know, um, you know, after um, you know, my, I got all those tests. Basically, my immune system shut down. And then allowed for myself to get um, a really severe infection in my arm, which I'm on antibiotics for now, um, and I haven't been able to train. So this is this is you know pretty much my first leg workout back since I've been on the antibiotics, and uh, I also got the flu as well. So you know basically um, gave myself fatigue, um, the flu, and an infection all within two week time frame. I've been in the, I've been in the doctors you know, three times in the last seven days. So it's been a bit of a struggle. It's been a battle, you know, mentally because I was, I was so wound up. I was so, you know, I was geared really, I was really highly strung for so long and uh, being told to back off and, you know, rest the body. It's like, how do I do that? I'm, you know, mentally I've been struggling with it and trying to tell myself it's okay to back off and pump the brakes and learn how to recover and rest. And, you know, my coach, and all my friends around me just, you know, supporting me and we're, you know, this isn't going to be the end. Basically, we're just going to allow my body to rest and recover, uh, reformulate things and we're basically going to go into, um, look at uh, the next show, what we're going to do. Because ultimately, the Arnold Classic is where I'm headed. That's why I was doing this, this show to qualify for that, which is in March next year. Um, so, you know, there's another... A um, couple of shows that I can pull off that. So it's not the end. I'll be back. Um, at the end of the day, every setback is a setup for a comeback, and I truly believe that. So I'm going to be more motivated, more hungry after this. You know, once I get my health back, I'm just clearing the last bit of the flu out of my body now. Hence the reason why I'm back in here in the gym straight away. You know, I couldn't I couldn't keep away. I just want to work. I just want to grind, and you know, my productivity definitely suffered a lot. You know, the last fortnight and um, I feel like I've got I need to catch back up and I've got a lot of ground to make up and I'm definitely more motivated than ever to get back on it so I just want to give you guys an update on that because um, yeah, I, I know that I, I was super excited about this prep and I was coming in really really good so you know this is only going to give me more time to come up come in even better because the last thing at the end of the day I don't want to get on that stage not being 100% my best, you know. I, I know I deserve um, the opportunity to bring my best package and not just rush it, not push it, um, you know, and come in like anything less than my 100%. So, you know, that's what's happening and, um, you know, it's a bit of a bummer, but such is life and we're getting back into it now. This is also giving me the opportunity to get more content cranking so you know I was getting a little bit tired and the vlogs were starting to back off a little bit so now I'm going to put more energy and effort into those to give you guys more fresh content. I've got some really cool things lined up um, you know over the next few weeks that I'm really excited to um, show you guys so make sure you guys stay tuned for all that and um, I just want to say I love you guys and thanks for watching and um, please subscribe at the end of this video hit the little like button as well show your love it's much appreciated guys so you know um, it's, it's getting late now we just finished the leg workout for the week getting up really early in the morning because we are filming all day tomorrow um, we've got some really cool stuff so make sure you keep um, your eyes peeled for that catch you next time